read that book like three years ago. So it's a good, good book. book. It's a good book. It's a great book. I'm glad you did. I'm reading it right now. On this it might have helped me get here, to be honest. You know, I'm reading it right now on this training camp leading into beating your ass. Not gonna happen. Not gonna happen, Johnny boy. Not gonna happen. Great, great response, Dominic. You're not special, Dominic. Oh, I'm this. I'm the one. I promise you. You, you will beat, see. You knocked out Chris Whiteman. He's been knocked out so many times. You knocked. Good job. When was the last time you knocked anyone out ever? I don't have to knock out people. I don't have to knock out people. I have a, I have a gigantic so skill set. So you say I don't have to knock out people, but no, then listen, you try to knock the, me knocking the, out people? The only okay. way, we all know the, okay, only, John. the only way you can possibly win this fight is it, it's to catch me with, with, with the left. We all know that. I could submit you, I could out-wrestle you, I can kickbox you to death. Bro, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you, Dominic. All right. We'll see. You know it. John Jones is, I mean, similar to the four minute mile, right? Nobody can run a four minute mile until somebody did. And as soon as one guy did it, all sorts of people are doing it. Not so impressive. Well, then it becomes a three minute mile. Nobody can do a three minute mile. Well, until one guy did. Now, all of a sudden, all sorts of people are doing it. It's just a very real part about human nature. And we will see it in sports, particularly combat sports. So now he's in a really great spot where all of a sudden the four minute mile starts to apply. All of a sudden there is a question of can he continue to beat these guys? He was a seven and a half to one favorite over Santos. One judge thought he lost the contest. Many media people thought he lost the contest. Many of the crowd thought he lost the contest. You're now giving the next guys the four minute mile lesson. When the mask comes off, when Buster Douglas knocks out Tyson, when Anderson runs into problems for the first time, when John Jones has a judge saying he lost a fight to a guy who was a seven and a half to one underdog that moved up from middleweight that wasn't unblemished there, all of a sudden you start seeing this guy's beatable. Whether anybody can go out there and beat him or not, they now believe the team. This is what drives the industry. There is now some intrigue around his ability. There's some intrigue around the outcome. Thiago Santos knocked the hell out of him. It didn't bother John Jones a bit. <laughs> John Jones didn't even try to take that fight to the ground. He's a tough son of a bitch. But I don't think people realize how tough he is. You can either be the best in the world at your field, or you can be the toughest in the world at your field. Either one can lead you to a world championship or an Olympic gold medal. Very, very rarely. Once a decade is an athlete bowl. John's both. 